Hi, I'm Francis. And this is yet again of why you should use standard algorithm talk. Um, yeah, uh, so recently, beginning of 2022, I decided to do a small uh, personal project, just create a kind of database of benchmarking of algorithms. And what I mean by that is probably everybody here has at least once in a code review seen somebody re-implement an algorithm with a for loop, which is a problem for the following reason, asterisks. Um, but let's start with when you're developing code in your iteration loop, uh, developing code, do you use debug or release build? Yes. That's the answer I was looking for. Raise your hand if you're using release build to develop code day to day and debug it. Okay. Who's using the debug version? Okay, that's more what I expected. Great. Except don't use a personal implementation of standard algorithms with MSVC in debug. That's the arguments you can, uh, th there's two order of magnitude uh, for like just mismatch here. Those are millisecond. I also ran it on GCC and Clang. They're, those are more reasonable numbers. Makes sense. But MSVC is just, I don't know what's happening. I even, I wanted to open a gut bolt and start looking at the assembly generated and everything. Just didn't have the time and maybe skills. Uh, depends if you want to, your program to run fast or slow. The smaller ones are better. Um, so yeah, uh, mismatch here. I, I don't have a big collection. I literally picked two algorithms and just re-implemented them in like a naive working way. Like you would see of someone just want to find a mismatch in a vector or and they didn't know that stood mismatch was a thing. Um, so yeah, that's another argument for not using enrolled algorithm. Uh, there was supposed to be a gut bolt, uh, and those are the implementation that I benchmarked for the mismatch one, just for the sake of it. If you find a mistake in it, I'm kind of pretty sure I did it right. But yeah, so yeah, that was my talk. Don't use enrolled algorithms with MSVC. It's gonna tank your performance. And I don't know if it, you, nobody care. O3 is way okay. The compiler just sees through it and optimizes it everything away, but yeah, that's it. And that's my project, but there's barely, there's only those two algorithms implemented in it.